everyone, I'm Colleen with Awaken Catholic and this is Awaken the Saint. For those of us blessed with a close relationship with a brother or sister, we often find that life is just better when they're around. So it was with Saint Scholastica, who simply adored her brother, Saint Benedict. Born into a wealthy family in Nursia, Italy in the year 480, Scholastica was very close to her brother. It's said that she was a pious young girl who from a young age dedicated herself to the Lord. When her brother established his famous Benedictine monastery on Monte Cassino, she founded and governed her own monastery for nuns only five miles down the way. Once a year, the two would meet at a farmhouse in the country between the two monasteries. It was during these times that the siblings would discuss spiritual matters and sharpen each other in their faith. One such dialogue has become famous according to the dialogues of St. Gregory the Great. It reveals the last day they spent together. Scholastica and Benedict shared time in prayer and conversation as usual. When night began to fall, Benedict prepared to return with his monks to the monastery. But Scholastica, sensing that her death drew near, begged that her brother stay with her at the farmhouse until morning. Unwilling to break his own rules about spending a night outside the monastery, Benedict refused her request. So she went straight to the top. She asked God to allow her brother to stay with her. And just as Benedict was about to depart, a fierce thunderstorm rolled in, preventing him from leaving. Seeing this as her doing, Benedict cried out, God forgive you, sister, what have you done? Scholastica simply replied, I asked a favor of you and you refused. I asked it of God and he granted it. And so, of course, Benedict stayed. What else could he do with such a response of faith? The two of them spent the night in spiritual conversation. Three days later, while praying, Benedict saw his sister's soul like a white dove rising toward heaven. He went and buried her body in the tomb he had prepared for himself. Imagine having such a close relationship with God that he answers your simple request to spend more time with someone you love. What kind of pure faith she must have had. Scholastica and Benedict give us a view of what brotherly and sisterly relationships ought to be. Their love for one another was only increased because of their mutual love for God. As individuals, they chose Christ above earthly possessions. As siblings, they encouraged each other to grow spiritually, even when they didn't realize they needed it. Saint Scholastica, pray for us. Thank you for tuning in to Awaken the Saint. Awaken the Saint is a three minute daily show that unpacks the lives of the saints with practical messages for everyday life. Awaken the Saint is made in partnership by Spoke Street Media and Awaken Catholic. Spoke Street Media's mission is to amplify the voice of the Creator by fostering content that invites. We want to spread the message of the Gospel and the love of God through media. For more podcasts, visit SpokeStreet.com.